what will happen 12th of september welcome back guys it's crypto rocker from rockstar trading channel cardano smart contracts to hit public testnet on 12th of september this is massive news for cardano there's no going back guys cardano is ready for a lonzo update if you've been following cardano or the cryptocurrency market this is a very highly anticipated news we've seen cardano go absolutely parabolic in this video guys i'll be sharing with you what the update is i'll share with you some concerns as well there is some fud going around for cardano i'll share with you my thoughts on the criticism and more importantly guys i'll share with you exactly how i'm trading cardano and i'll share with you my thoughts on what i see happen to the price will it be a buy the rumor sell the news event we've seen previously i'll compare what happened with the shelly mainnet launch you know we had a really big rally towards the news and then we had a dip in price so what am i expecting i'll share with you my thoughts the youtube videos guys i share with you exactly how, what i'm looking to buy and sell in the previous video i talked about a cardano short and that doesn't mean i hate cardano i've been buying cardano since less than 10 cent but i did take a short on cardano and in the youtube videos guys i share with you exactly where i'm buying and selling watch my previous cardano video in the rockstar trading group guys i can post my entries exits this was my short entry when cardano was breaking below this zone and then it hit our target i'll share with you again all these posts you can go back and find all this post cardano hit our target and it's a really nice trade i'm quite happy with it uh, it dipped and hit my first target i took some profit i'll show you exactly how i'm trading it and what i'm expecting next so make sure you watch the video till the end and uh, if you are interested in rockstar trading group i'll leave the links below you can trial us for a month and see if this group is for you now let's get into the news so the big news is cardano smart contracts to hit public testnet on 12th of september so cardano announced a smart contract upgrade will launch on the public testnet this is quite a big news. Alonzo is a major step for, forward for Cardano, bringing smart contracts to a network that has de has been in development for years. It's one of the biggest upgrades to arrive and could make the network a real contender in the decentralized application. They're already calling it the most significant upgrade. And if Cardano is to compete with Ethereum, this is one of the Cardano needs to successfully launch this. And you know, lots of people are making you know this news out to be bigger than it actually is. Smart contract is. I think is a starting point. The key asset test for me would be can Cardano get developers coming into uh, their platform and using their ecosystem and building apps, D apps, real with real world use cases and people using it. That's going to be the key at the moment, in my opinion. Ethereum is still the king. Everyone still uses Ethereum. What we want to see is can Cardano, after launching smart contracts success successfully, get people using their ecosystem. So that's going to be the key question. Uh, Cardano's roadmap, roadmap is looking great. So we already know we are in the smart contract, the Gujon era. There's still a couple of errors to come, Basho and Voltaire, which we'll see governance, scaling, and technical improvements. Cardano's already got a really good track record of the improvements that they have done. And this, in my opinion, is the biggest one. If they, like I said, if they can launch it successfully, have people coming onto the Cardano ecosystem, then, you know, short time frame price, I'll share with you my thoughts and exactly how I'm trading it. But long term, I see Cardano price a lot, lot higher. So like I said, the, the team have confirmed there's no going back. They're launching on the 12th of uh, September. That's the exact time they're launching it. We are on our way. Uh, remember, this may be the end of a one long journey, but it's the start of an exciting phase in our development as smart contract network. We have lots of to share over the months ahead as our exciting ecosystem continues to grow lots of people saying they're buying and selling i'll share with you my thoughts and again don't hate on me if people say i'm bearish on cardano you need to be buying when it's less than 10 20 cent and selling or taking profit here cardano you know could go to i'm getting into the box down into the price i'm more of a trader as you can see you know if cardano goes to five dollars or ten dollars now there's still massive gains but there's still only like you know five x you know we are four x if it goes to ten dollars but you know from 20 cent to where it's now that's a 10x the risk to reward there's lots of other coins that are pumping you know we're looking to trade luna soul ftt some really small crazy cap coins that we're trading again check out my previous video of the group the smaller cap we're trading that's what i mean I, i'm not bearish on cardano i'm not saying cardano is not gonna go to five or ten dollars all i'm saying is i want to put my money i'm still holding cardano i'll talk about that but i think there's probably better potential altcoins out there for bigger crazier gains uh, let me know your thoughts do you believe me do you think i should just be holding cardano cardano is going to go higher that's just my opinion if you compare cardano's market cap 
The criticism that Cardano has, again, Cardano gets a lot of criticism, which I don't think is uh, probably justified. They, there's lots of people talking about FADA and stuff. But this is one something that you probably should bear of. It's not just FADA, I think. Anthony Susano talked about um, screenshots uh, showing concurrency issue found on the Cardano-based decentralized exchange MinSwap. The Dex became the first DApp that launched on Cardano Testnet. And um, the, basically, there's multiple users uh, from interacting with the program or protocol simultaneously. They're having issues with it. In Cardano's case, the problem likely stems from the absence of Cardano virtual machine, uh, like the Ethereum EVM that there is that allows smart contract operations. So that's the you know criticism of uh, Cardano. The way I like to see it is, guys, Cardano is at a very, very early stage. And yes, this could be a bump in the road and there might be a dip in the price. But if you believe in Charles Hodgkinson, his vision, I hope they're going to fix it and they're going to grow. This is a really, really early stage. It's not a time to just say, oh, this is a scam. It's going down. So in my opinion, again, I'm not an expert blockchain cryptographer or programmer, but again, this, this, I believe Cardano and Charles Hodgkinson will fix this issue going forward and it could be just a minor dip. So I don't want to scare people and scaremonger people uh, about this news. So that's the fundamental news. Now let's come back to the price. So the, the buy the rumor, sell the news event. Again, watch my videos on Cardano back in August uh, 2020. Check out my Litecoin halving video. This dip 73%. I made a video before the dip. The price was around there. You can go back and see this. This was in 2019. And it's not just in cryptocurrency, guys. It happens everywhere. People start buying the news when things are pumping. And then when the you know the news happens, people take profit and we get a dip. Last time with the Shelly Mainnet launch, it literally topped a couple of days before the Shelly mainnet launch date and it dipped about 60% going forward. Uh, at the moment, we're seeing that Alonzo uh, uh, updates 12th of September, a few days away. It's already, you know, hit the, hit the top and dipped quite a bit. It's dumped about 30-40%. Um, in my opinion, if you ask me what will happen, I see a dip coming in Cardano. Um, do I mean that this is the forever top is going to go to $1, $2? I'm not saying that. I think Cardano, uh, people are going to look to take profit. And if it rallies up, I think Cardano will going down. And, you know, people say, am I putting my money where my mouth is? And that is exactly where, what I'm doing. This is the trade I took. You know, it's, uh, this is a leverage short I took. And Cardano went down. It broke down. That's what that was my short. I can go back and, you know, in the Rockstar trade, in, in the YouTube videos, guys, I share with you exactly when i'm buying when i'm selling and all that good stuff in the rockstar trading group i can post my updates there's live stream courses strategy videos all that good stuff and again if you want to stay up to date with what your coins are doing where bitcoin ethereum is going you can check us out there's a one month trial as well you can trial us see if this group is for you i posted that trade setup and i actually didn't want this trade to work out because Although my Cardano short made me money, I lost money on the other coins that I was holding. You know, all the market dropped, you know, my bag, biggest bags, you know, I don't want to share with you all my coins, but my, one of my favorite ones that I've shared with you on YouTube, Luna, AXS, FTT. So they all dipped as well. So overall, my portfolio is down, but Cardano short worked really well and um, I made some decent money on it. Um, and I think Cardano will head lower. So you know, that's great, Rocco. You made money. Rockstar Traders made money. What's going to happen next? So I think Cardano is going to dip into uh, the news. So the way I traded is I posted that, guys. I sold half uh, and leaving 25% to run. And that was my plan. Uh, let me just share this with you. So 25, selling another 25% at this zone. And then you can literally go back and check all the posts. These are all step-by-step -step, uh, sharing with you. So I've taken 25% off this trade. Uh, and I'm leaving. So I'm taking half then i've taken another 25 percent leaving 25 percent to run and that was my target and now i'll see what happens if cardano starts breaking by three dollars i'm wrong i'll i'll lose that 25 percent but you know i'm not saying short all your cardano now because it's already dipped about you know i want to be shorting before it dumps it's already dumped 30 percent, and that's why i've exited my short if cardano comes back to 280 i might look for another short position targeting two dollars and maybe a bit lower but at the moment, I'm not looking for shorts and I've exited my short. The other short that I've got at 25%, I'll leave it to run. I might get stopped out or it will go lower. So what to do if you're you know, looking to buy it, if you're looking to short Cardano again, look to short a pullback towards maybe 270, 280, target $2 and maybe a bit lower. If Cardano starts breaking below $2 and 180, I think Cardano will dip a lot lower and I think it will head towards you know, 150, uh, uh, 150 zone. That is where I look to reaccumulate, rebuy Cardano. It's really important for Cardano not to lose 150 to $1 zone. As long as Cardano is holding above $1, high time frame on the daily, weekly, I think Cardano goes higher. So for a short time frame, look for a pullback short targeting $2. If you are looking to buy Cardano, my zone 
to buys 150 to one dollar i'm not going to blindly buy it and if cardano drops to one dollar like a 70 percent dip i'm just going to blindly buy some you've seen me blindly buy chain link at five dollars and you type in chain link these are all cold before it happens and then um, i'm going to look to buy blindly there but ideally what i'd like to see is some consolidation some accumulation and use my strategy i, I use a pullback to moving average strategy to buy cardano here for the next leg up so that's how i'm looking to trade it write those zones down and, and follow it see if it works if it doesn't work you know you can tell me rocco hasn't worked but write this down try to follow and try to trade these levels and you'll see how they how nicely they work and watch my all my other videos you know i was extremely bullish on cardano when they were breaking out at the moment i've taken it short like i've said and if cardano breaks above three dollars i'm wrong pump it again and you know, if it starts coming into these levels i'm gonna look to buy it so that's my that's how i'm trading it to summarize my prediction, uh, I think Cardano will head a bit lower to us $2 uh, next and I potentially to $150. I think this is a zone where Cardano will dip into and that's where I'm going to look to accumulate Cardano like I have said. After the news long term, I see Cardano going higher, especially if they can deliver smart contracts, have developers developing on their uh, ecosystem. I see Cardano price going to a lot higher, $5, $10 or some uh, even in the next few years if Bitcoin, Ethereum are pumping, Cardano can go to some crazy numbers. People call me crazy for saying $1 Cardano. Look at, you know, where the price of Cardano is now. If you just read the comments of my videos back in 2020, 2019, people were calling me scammer for saying Cardano to $1. And people will call, call out names now because I'm shorting. But I'm just sharing with you how I trade, how I move my money and move my money into the right things. So that's my thoughts on Cardano. What is your thoughts on Cardano? Do you think Cardano is going to, you know, pump to five dollars will it dump to one dollar will there be a short pullback let me know in the youtube comment section or you know join the twitter uh, and then comment there so my friend and myself run this twitter account let us know what your thoughts are on cardano do you believe in cardano smart contracts do you think cardano is gonna go absolutely parabolic even after the news but do you agree with me that cardano is probably going to pull back towards the news there will be a buy the rumor sell the news event and in the future it will continue going higher so comment below your price prediction for cardano so thank you very much guys and um, smash that like button if you've enjoyed that video if you uh want to learn more content like this i'm going to make another cardano video and i always talk if i'm wrong as well i'll make another cardano video look at you know how my prediction worked out so make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification button to stay up to date with cardano if you want more cardano videos let me know i'll try and make more cardano vid videos going into detail of the cardano project charles hodgkinson and my thoughts in a lot more detail on how i'm trading cardano keep you guys up to date on a weekly basis so thank you very much for watching this video smash that like button subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much